just doing a quick live into one of the groups that I have. Um, I've done the menopause group this morning, checked in on everybody. And now I need to check in onto the body cleanse group. So as you know, I run a body cleanse and it's 30 days. Um, people drop about 15 pounds, sometimes more, depending on where their starting point is. But mainly it's just teaching people how to eat properly uh, to make the right food choices. So in the long run, their future health is obviously better. Their blood sugar's better. They won't suffer from diabetes. The menopause symptoms will be eased, etc., etc. The lower your BMI, the healthier you will be into the future. You will be disease free. Basically, we dig our grave with our teeth. So let's do the live. This is how it goes. Hello, July 30 DTX, how are we doing? So I'm just checking in with you to see how you did this weekend. I'd love to see some posts of what everybody was eating. I know Sharon will put a couple up there and thanks Sharon for sharing your chocolate delights at the weekend. What did you have this weekend? I'm really, really curious to find out. Lisa, oh, hi darling, how are you? Um, just wanna find out what everyone was eating this weekend. If you post your food up, I'll post mine. Um, actually went for a Sunday lunch, but had a really clean Sunday lunch. So didn't go for gravy, didn't go for the sauces and just kept it really plain. So it does mean when you're on the cleanse, you can still eat out. This is not a diet. It's teaching you the right foods to have at the right time. So if you are going out for dinner, make sure you opt for the clean variety always ask us if they're steamed vegetables so at this roast dinner they had loads and loads of green veg so i filled my plate up with the veg first then put the meat on in fact i didn't eat all the meat didn't really feel like it because on the cleanse you don't you don't really need to overeat on the protein because you, your body feels so much more balanced oh, i love you too lisa i do miss you lisa's away at the moment and uh, we used to train together and she loves the cleanse. She has one of those bodies that has a beautiful small waist anyway, but um, because of age, we tend to, to gain more weight. And so on the cleanse, Lisa found she had really good results with her waistline. And I hope you are keeping up the good eating, Lisa, now that you're away. Um, Jay, hi, how are you doing? So I'm asking everyone in the group, please, please share your meals because if you share what you're doing, it's gonna motivate everybody else, yeah? And if you put your dinner up, I will put mine <laughs> about that. Um, just remember to stick with it, don't fall off. If you do feel that um, you're coming, you know, it's sort of the end of the cleanse really, isn't it now? Um, if you feel a little bit disorientated or you don't really know where you're going with it or you've started to plateau, make sure you take your measurements then um, reach out because that's what the group is for. So the more you reach out, the more myself and Joanna and the other coaches in the group can really help you get the body that you want. And more so than that, feel good, yeah? Your energy's lifted. So stick to it, keep going, clean food, look in the Ultimate Recipe Book, it's up here in the files section, use that as a resource. Um, and don't reach for the high sugar, high fat foods. If you are finding that you're not eating regularly, you're gonna be more inclined to reach for those incorrect foods, which then keep, get you going into that spiral of negativity with your body and also your body fat and your mind. So let's keep it clean, let's eat well this week and please post some meals. So all these people are coming to see Greece today in Lewis at the depot. So I thought I'd just make the effort. Bag. So we're at Greece. We have our own, very own bags. So, right, if you've never been to a cinema viewing where everyone does this, <laughs> you really need to get to one, it's such fun. So we've had, we've had um, some of these pom-poms <laughs> for when Sandy beats Danny. Uh, we've been singing out the lyrics. What else have we been doing? Um, where's the other bit? What else? Where's the nappy? I want to show the nappy. So every time, every time they say baby in Greece, you have to hold up a child's nappy. Oh, there, there's one. What are these? <laughs> and then obviously, can't go without this. Home. 
So just leaving now, how cool was that? It was amazing. So Greece, where you have to actually join in and <laughs> be a kid. So anyone that wants to be a kid, you should get down here. Where are we again? Lewis, what's the name of the place? The depot. The depot. <laughs> Lewis, the depot. Get there if you want to go and have some fun, a little bit of experience, take your kids, take your grandparents, go and have a giggle.